Not so very long ago, there was a small boy named Nikolai. Nikolai lived in a very big house with all his toys and with all his books and with his very, very naughty friend, Yao Yao. Each day they would do many special things, but one thing they would always do is ride their trains. And now let's go and play. <laughs> Nikolai, don't touch my toys. These are all my toys, and this, this is my house. That's not true, Ninya. Yes, it is. Ninya, I'll be good and stop this nonsense. And now let's go and play. The outer planets. The solar system is made up of a central star and the bodies around it. These include the nine planets, their 61 moons, millions of asteroids and meteoroids, trillions of comets, interplanetary gas and dust. All these bodies are held in their orbits by the sun's gravity. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the Sun. It is the largest planet. It is so large that all the other planets could fit inside it. The planet, including its surface, is made up mostly of hydrogen gas. Jupiter spins the fastest, with a day only lasting 10 Earth hours. Jupiter has 16 moons. planet is usually the outermost planet from the Sun, only passing inside Neptune's orbit for 20 years of its 248 year orbit of the Sun. Because Pluto is so far from the Sun, it is the coldest planet. Its surface is covered with ice and frozen methane. Pluto has one known moon. One day on Pluto lasts almost seven Earth days. The Outer Planets The inner planets. The sun is the center of our solar system. 
It is so huge that the Earth could fit in it more than a million times. The Sun is a star which consists of hydrogen and helium gases. In the Sun's core, hydrogen is converted to helium. This conversion process releases enormous amounts of energy which leaves the Sun as heat and light. The Sun is almost 5 billion years old and will shine for about another 5 billion years. smallest planet is the nearest planet to the Sun. It is therefore extremely hot. The Sun shines on its surface at ten times the intensity as here on Earth. Mercury's rocky surface has many craters which were created by meteorites. A day on Mercury lasts 176 Earth days, but unlike Earth, which orbits around the Sun every 365 days, it takes only 88 days for Mercury to complete its orbit. The hopper car. Steel hopper cars carry loose materials like coal, gravel, grain, and different kinds of ore. They can either be open or covered. Hopper cars are loaded from the top and unload their cargo from the bottom. The flat cars. Flat cars have no top or walls. They haul cargo such as logs, pipes, or pieces of machinery such as tractors. The cargo is held on the flat car by chains and stakes along the side. The tank car. Tank cars carry liquids and come in more than 200 different varieties. Cars that carry chemicals are lined with rubber, lead or aluminum. Tank cars have one or more domes on top. In warm weather, liquid expands and goes into the dome. The refrigerator car. Because refrigerator cars are insulated and have cooling units, they carry produce, such as fruit, vegetables, meat, and fish. The cattle car. 
A cattle car carries livestock. The slits in the side are to let fresh air into the car for the animals. Meow Meow's train was an old steam engine. He was very proud of it, and he would always boast to Nikolai about how much faster and stronger and better it was than Nikolai's train. Stop! Hmm, I think it's time for a little lunch. My train is faster and stronger than Nikolai's train. I'm sure if we had a race that my train would win. Hmm, looks like they're running a little low on coal. What is that a little man here? Yeah. That should do it. My train is faster and stronger than Nikolai's train. I'm sure if we had a race that my train would win. <laughs> well, howdy, yo. Yo, come visit now, you here? Steam engines were the first machines used to pull trains. Before the steam engine, horses pulled trains along the track. The way a steam engine works is quite simple. Coal is burned in the firebox, heating the water in the large boiler to make steam. It's the expanding steam that creates the forces which drive the engine. Pipes take the steam to the main cylinders which contain the pistons that slide back and forth inside. A sliding valve alternately directs the steam to each end of each cylinder to move the piston. As the pistons move, the connecting rods attached to them turn the wheels of the train. Nikolai's train was a diesel engine. It was all black, which was Nikolai's favorite color. Nikolai would tell Nyao Nyao that his engine could pull thousands of coaches, all filled with many strange and wonderful objects. My train is better than Nyao's because it has a diesel engine. It can pull 10,000 coaches, 
In fact, my train can go faster on Thursday than the nearest train. Today, yesterday, and tomorrow. It is very important that trains run on time. The railroad companies make timetables so that passengers will know when their train is at the station. These timetables also help keep the railway safe by making sure that two trains are not in the same place at the same time. Everyone working on the railroad, especially the engineer and the station master, needs to know exactly what time it is. The large clocks at the train station help them keep the trains on schedule. 12 o'clock. One o'clock, one o'clock, two o'clock, Diesel engines were first used in locomotives in the 1930s. These diesels were very efficient internal combustion engines that could generate much more power than a steam engine. In a diesel electric locomotive, the diesel engine is used to generate electricity. The electricity powers traction motors connected to each of the wheels through gears. These motors drive the train and can help slow it down too. The gears are used to turn the wheels more slowly, but with greater power. My train is better than the nails because it has these ones. It can pull 10,000 coaches. In fact, my train can go faster on Thursday than the nails train. Today, yesterday, and tomorrow. Train signals. Trains are often long and heavy. They can be very hard to stop, especially in an emergency. For safety, signals are necessary to let the engineer know if it's safe to proceed. In the early days of railways, signals were given by signalmen holding flags and lamps. As trains could go faster, train signals became automated and used mechanical flags and electric lights. Three signals tell an engineer how to drive his train. All clear. Proceed with caution. Stop. Proceed with caution. All clear. Stop. One day, Nikolai and Yao Yao decided to race and boarded their trains. Just before the starter fired his pistol, 
Meow Meow released his brakes and raced away. Let's go! Let's go! I'm leaving! Bye! Now stop it, otherwise I'll have to call Santa Claus and tell him how naughty you are, Bink. Here we go! Here we go! Move out of the way! Come on, move out of the way! Get ready, get set! Let's go! Let's go! I'm leaving! Bye! Get ready, get set! Hey, come back here! Ooh, la, 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 la. I'm winning! I'm winning already! Suddenly, Nyao Nyao gasped. The lineman had not changed the switch, and Nyao Nyao's train crashed against the bumper near the shed where Nikolai stored his diesel fuel. Ah! What a mess! What can I do? You crazy cats in your trains! Look what you've done! <laughs> While Nyao Nyao had his train fixed, Nikolai waited patiently. What am I going to do? I need help to put my train back together again. Would you please click on the different parts of my train when I say their names? Wheels! Stop that! What are you doing? Oh, 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 Try again. Pistons. Try again. Could you try again, please? Try again.
Could you try again, please? Try again. Could you try again, please? Smokestack! Headlamp! Dum 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 Steam Dome! Try again! Could you try again, please? Cow Catcher! Bill! Thank you! Thank you! My train! My train! Wait, wait, wait for me! Now we will have to start the race all over again, Ninyao. I'm sorry, Nikolai. This time I'll be a good Ninyao. The race course was long and difficult, and the finish line far, far away. The trains went through forests. Over hills. Small towns. And into large cities. But no matter how fast Niao Niao tried to make his train go, Nikolai's train was always just a little bit faster. Oh no! Oh no! I must find a way to win! What a long race.
long place. As he approached a big wooden bridge, Meow Meow saw a small siding which led to a dark tunnel. He pulled the lineman's switch and took his train down the track leading to the tunnel. La 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 la! This is probably a shortcut to the finish line. If I take my train through this tunnel, I'll win! Before Nyao Nyao reached the entrance, he noticed a small door cut into the side of the mountain. Over the door was a sign which read, no cats allowed. Silly sign! The door led to an old mine. Inside there were many strange and dark things. Oh, 
The coal mine. Under the surface of the earth there are many useful metals and minerals. These include metals like iron, copper, silver, and gold. They also include minerals such as salt, diamonds, and the coal used to fuel steam engines. The underground shafts and passages that are dug to bring these materials to the surface is called a mine. Coal is a hard black mineral made up mostly of carbon from plants that lived in ancient forests and in the oceans thousands of years ago. Suddenly, Meow Meow heard a loud crash. Meow Meow ran outside. He saw that the wooden bridge had collapsed. There was no sign of Nikolai's train. If he was going to win the race, there was no time to lose. Meow Meow climbed into his steam engine and drove his train into the tunnel. Oh! Oh no!
The hydrologic cycle. Water flows across the globe in an endless repeating cycle called the hydrologic cycle. The cycle begins when water on the earth, from the river, lakes, and oceans, from the ground and from the leaves of plants, is heated by the sun and evaporates. These warm water vapors rise up and gather to form clouds in the sky. When the clouds cool, they condense into droplets of water that fall back to the earth as rain or snow if the temperature is cold enough. The soil absorbs some of this water which is taken up by the plants. The rest flows back into the rivers, lakes and oceans, and the cycle begins again. When he reached the other side of the mountain, Nyao Nyao realized that he was lost in a dark forest. Nyao Nyao panicked and jumped off his train. He heard heavy footsteps, and then he saw a giant footprint. Now he was really scared. Oh, I wish I hadn't been such a naughty Nyao. God, I was just kidding! Jeez, what a grouch! <laughs> Weasel. Look at the cat! He's lost in the forest! Oh! <laughs> you hit me! The fox says there's a plump little cat around here. Oh, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> hey, kid. Uh, you better get out of this forest as fast as your delicious le I mean, your furry little legs can move. <laughs> Oh, 
I wish the Nikolai was here. I hope that giant is not hiding near here waiting for a naughty Ninyao like me. Suddenly, there was a noise from above, and the sky grew dark. Ever so slowly, Nyo Nyo looked up and saw someone looking down at him through the trees. Oh no! Oh no! It must be the giant! He's come to get me! He's come to get me! Actually, it was not a giant at all. It was Nikolai, who was very big compared to Nyao Nyao. You see, Nyao Nyao is only a toy. Don't be scared now, it's only me. <laughs> Don't be scared me now, it's only me. Okay, are you guys gonna watch me? I'm only gonna do this once. Ready? Ah! I am so good, I have got to find an agent. Nikolai had been worried that Nyao Nyao had taken a wrong turn. He had come back to find his friend because it was late and time to stop playing. Nyao Nyao was very happy to see Nikolai and promised, as much as he could, never to be anything but a good Nyao Nyao. Oh. And now it's getting late, it's time to stop playing. No, I want to finish the race. Now remember your palms to be a good Ninyao. Now it's time to go to sleep. Good night, Ninyao.
Oh. <sighs>